Okay guys, so I've been seeing this Lumen skincare advert crop up on my Facebook newsfeed quite a few times now. I really don't like this advert, but it's actually incredibly good advert. The people in it, I find really annoying, but this is actually a really well-made ad and they're gonna convert a lot of customers from this. So let's take a look at it. I don't really have a skincare routine, but my girl wants me to take better care of it, so she got me Lumen. It's a 90 second skincare routine and it's delivered to your door. Let's try it out. So this is the charcoal cleanser. This is good for excess oil, dead skin, clogged pores. Very refreshing smell. I should have been doing this a long time ago. <laughs> What's next? This is the exfoliating rub. So this stuff is good for acne scars and shaving irritation. I did not know my skin needed something like this. My face already feels so much better. Last but not least, the moisturizing balm. This is really good for hydration. Immediately just feels so much better. So good. How much was this? It was free. I just had to pay for shipping. What? On the very first frame of the ad, we have the quote, nothing is sexier than a man who takes care of himself, right? Sexier, they have obviously you put the word sex into the very opening frame. These adverts are gonna be shown on Facebook. So the attention span is very small for the people who are watching it. So they need to grab attention very quickly. And then straight away, we have the money shot. Now this shot here is a very powerful stimulus for a man, especially a man who's not generally not good with girls, right? Not successful. This is very powerful to him. So you have the girl rubbing her face on the man's fresh skin, right? Um, this is a clear message, right? The message is this product will lead to success with women. It's simple. But the thing is, this is a very deep drive for men. So it's very powerful, you know. Many men will see this and they will take notice, right? They see this one image of the pretty attractive girl rubbing her nose on the guy's face. And that is going to grab the attention of many men. Get okay, a lot of men. Uh, because we're naturally inclined to, to be motivated to be successful with women, you know. I don't really have a skincare routine, but my girl wants me to take better care of it, so she got me Lumen. As you can see at the bottom here, it says, those appearing in this video were compensated for their time, testimonial, and use of their image. In other words, these are paid actors and these are not genuine people. I mean, to be honest, that's pretty obvious anyway, but there is this kind of facade still. It's shot in the style of a vlog right like a fashion or skincare vlogger so it seems uh, it still has the facade of being a genuine person and because of that you kind of feel a bit more like you can trust them audiences are used to seeing these flashy well-produced adverts for skincare and many audiences are now brushing that off because they've seen it a hundred times but this is something new this is a, a vlog style advert and, and the audience will have a sense that they can trust this guy and what he and the girl and what they say because they are genuine people. I mean, obviously they're not, but you know, subconsciously that's how you feel. It's a 90 second skincare routine and it's delivered to your door. Let's try it out. So she says it's a 90 second skincare routine and we'll deliver it to your door. Or in other words, it's easy, you can be lazy, we'll do all the work for you, right? People don't wanna be inconvenienced and she is knocking that excuse or that objection out the window because she's making the purchase of these things, these products really easy. Now, so far, they have stacked three reasons to buy this product already. Number one, it'll make you successful with girls. Number two, it'll only take 90 seconds to apply. And number three, it's delivered to your door, right? They've stacked three reasons to buy already so this is the charcoal cleanser this is good for excess oil dead skin clogged pores very refreshing smell i should have been doing this a long time ago <laughs> so he says i should have been doing this a long time ago right of course what's he saying here he's speaking to the audience and making the audience feel as if 
they should have been doing this a long time ago and that they are missing out for not using this product, right? What's next? This is the exfoliating rub. So this stuff is good for acne scars and shaving irritation. I did not know my skin needed something like this. Once again, he says, I did not know my skin needed something like this. So he's speaking to the audience because the audience also did not know that their skin needed something like this. He's trying to get the audience to feel like they are missing out, right? And that they should be already using this product. My face already feels so much better. And here we go. So we've had a before. In the before shot, his face looked a little bit red, kind of. His skin was already fine, right? But it looked a little bit red. And then in the after shot right here, his skin suddenly looks very white. The quiet assumption that is made by the audience is that he used the product to get his face to look better, right? The reality is when they were making this commercial, they probably added makeup to his face for the after shot. I'm not a makeup expert, so I can't be sure, but my guess is that they've actually added foundation or whatever on his face, subtle makeup to make him look better. They probably didn't actually use the product to get his face to look that way. Better. Last but not least, the moisturizing balm. It's really good for hydration. Immediately, just feels so much better. So good. How much was this? It was free, I just had to pay for shipping. What? And then we have that really cheesy ending at the end where she says, it was free, I just had to pay for shipping. And he says, what? Like, the implication here is, could this deal get any better? You know, I can't believe it. Um, and now they have stacked four reasons um, and this is what adverts will do right they will stack reasons to buy the product on top of each other until it's kind of overwhelming and it seems like the the choice to buy is obvious you know first of all it will help with your skin and it will get you the ladies number two it takes 90 seconds to apply number three it's delivered to your door and number four you only have to pay for shipping and it just seems like the deal is unbelievably good, right? Of course, uh, yes, you only pay for shipping. The shipping is about $5, right? But the, the hope is that number one, many buyers will continue to want the product after they buy it. And then the second month, they will pay for the, the full price for the moisturizing balm and they'll continue to pay this price for the next you know, year. Um, I checked the website and the price for these three products is, is a lot. I believe it was like $71 per month, right? So if you think about that, if, this, if these people continue to be subscribed for another year, well, do the math, 71 times 12. Um, you're talking about $800 per subscription. So I wanted to check on the Lumen website what would happen if you tried to cancel your subscription. Um, now let's take a look at the message you get. To be fair, the option to unsubscribe is pretty easy to find, but then they give you this page. Now at the top of this little uh, heading here, we have don't be that guy with a face palming emoji next to it. It's basically a tactic to try to shame the customer into not uh, unsubscribing. Um, yeah, it's pretty manipulative, but you know, basically every website does this these days. Underneath that, we have an, a discounted offer for those who uh, who will stay and they'll get 30% off the next three boxes, right? That's another attempt to keep people subscribed. Below that, we have the big gray button that says delay and save an extra 30%. So even this is not the cancel button. Uh, now, the truth is many people will click that button just assuming, without reading it, just assuming that this is the cancel button. Uh, but no, this is a delay on the subscription and then after the first um, saving of 30%, the price will go back up to uh, full price, $71 per month. The cancel button is right here at the bottom in tiny little writing, as you can see down there. Um, they really want people to stay subscribed, right? Like I said, some people will want to stay subscribed for the product, but others will forget. Uh, anyway, guys, that was the Lumen advert. I thought it'd be interesting to take a look at that. So thanks for watching. See ya.